Welcome back folks, welcome back to Let's Play Mountain Blade Warband. When as we left off, uh, we were doing a tournament. 100 dinars. If you bet 100, you earn 1,000 dinars. Wait, forget it. You will earn uh, 1,300 dinars. Oh, wait. So, sure, go ahead. Fight for the next round. Ah yes, this is more my style. And there we go. You there, idiot. Die. You there, also idiot. Die. Count Falsivor, you suck. Place about myself. Hundred denies. Go ahead. Fight him in the next round. Oh, bugger. Well. Should have guessed as much. Why are you. This is so unfair. This is so unbelievably unfair. You git. You gave me a knife. They gave me a knife. What the hell? Damn it! I've been eliminated from a tournament, I should have guessed as much. That's really annoying, you gave me a freaking knife? And everyone else had swords? You git. Oh my god. Uh, Kudan, okay. That's the problem with a tournament. They can give you the worst freaking things. Kudan is around here, right? Where's Kudan? <sighs> There's Kudan. Ah, oh, that's really annoyed me. If they gave me a bow and arrow against three people with swords. Why did they give me a bow? <sighs> Yeah, problem it. Well, I join a tournament, place a bet on myself. 100 Nars. Go ahead. Fight him the next round. Okay, this is slightly better. I mean, it's not amazing, but it could be, it's better. I have no other weapons, so jousting will have to do. Okay, I'm yellow. I don't know how to use a lance, by the way. Oh, good job, there, man. Mercenary swordsman. You there, you seem to be a threat. How did you block that? Okay, I'm sort of getting the hang of using a lance. Never been able to really use them. This is going to be a slower battle. Okay. Anyone have a sword or anything better? Okay, nobody here has a sword. That's sort of annoying. 27 da 29 damage to horse effect. There we go. Come on. There we go. We're getting somewhere.
Thank God for the AI in this game being poor. So you're just going to keep running at me. So I may as well just sort of circle around and butt you with my the edge of my jowls. A bugger at all. And there you go. Killed your horse. You know, it would be easy if I had, you know, like, any other weapon, but... Well, if it wasn't a freaking knife, that's gonna really bug me. They gave me three archers against a bunch of people with decent weapons. As I know, I cannot do archery to save my life. I was debating whether to make this an archery one, but I decided that would get me nowhere, because I can't aim in this game. I can only vaguely swing in the enemy's direction. That seems to help. going on for Jesus Christ how are you all entertained by this this is not it's just me going around in a circle hitting this person with a stick you know you can probably get someone by just walking up to you and punching you in the face even if that does literally no damage delivered five damage Okay, you're, you don't have a lance. There we go. Yay. Zarina. Play spell on yourself. 100 dinars. No, nope, 100 dinars. Go ahead. Fight him in the next round. Damn it. Okay, everyone's got lances here. Okay. Come on. Oh god, this is going to not be fun. There we go. God damn it, hired blade. Oh, I did not mean to do that, folks. I apologize. Come on. There we go. Swords of the you could have done better. Solvents. This is just silly. As I'm just chipping at them. Okay. As a note, dismount. Practice javelins. I can stab people with these. I can also throw them. But that, it's not going to get any more serious than this. Come on. There we go. See, I can work with practice javelins. Can't work with a freaking knife. Damn it. Come on to the horse to him. 
There we go. Headshot. Champion fighter gets knocked out as one guy continuously throwing a single set of javelins at his face. Mate, could you... Oh. The almighty blue team as they throw javelins at this one man. Oh, you think you can take us out, do you, Mr. Yellow team member? Well, I think not. Most interesting battle of all time. As I throw these jab- Look at how many ch There we go! Who's left? Oh, there we go. Okay, only going for 11 minutes. Place a bet on myself, 100 dinars. Go ahead. Three teams for three fighters. Fight the next round. Ah, uh, more practice javelins. Fun. Oh, come on. No. I could tell the final battle is going to be like me against like, I don't know, someone in like mech armor and I'm going to have a bow and arrow and a knife. Also, uh, there's one thing I don't get. This game, like with the aiming, it goes on shot difficulty for when you attack someone. That's surely someone throwing a javelin at someone's back at full force from literally next to them. That's got to do a lot more damage than if you were like ages away. Well, I'm saying that, that's probably not true. But thinking on it, I'm an idiot. Shut up. Shut up, me. There we go. But it should do a lot more damage than nine, is what I'm saying. Because if we get a specific way, gravity could do a lot more damage than, you know, simply throwing it. But you're still throwing a javelin at someone's face. That's got to count for something. And that's something it's not 11 damage. Is that it? Oh no, it's still a few more. Come on. There we go. How many more men are there? None. Place a bet on myself. 100 and ours. Go ahead. Two teams, two fighters each. Fighting the next round. Oh, eight participants still remain. More! Oh no! Bow and arrow. Help me, you git! You there, friend. There we go. Just whack him in the face with my knife. That knocks him out. Ah, go against the wall, you idiot with a javelin. Because that will do no damage to me now. Come on, regular fighter. This has no aim. Give me a sec to line myself up. Thank you. There we go. Four participants, two teams of one fire, 100 dinars. Go ahead. Fight over the next round. What do you have? You have a s more practice javelins. Come on, we can do this. If only they gave me a sword, that'd make this. A lot more endurable. Now this should be the final battle after this. Get two participants. Place a bet on myself. A hundred dinars. Go ahead. Fight in the next round. And practice javelins.
Come on, just wait for him to try and stab me at close range. And then I win. That's a lot of, that was an easier tournament. And 2,000 dinars and... <laughs> oh god, I got 4,000 from that. That is... Quite the nice bit of money. Time to start my second enterprise, I think. To start it off. How much money do I have now? 7,000. Thank you, money. And if I give it maybe a few weeks or so, people forget how good I was in that, and I get into another tournament and get even more. Take a walk around the streets. In fact, first I'm going to see how much time I have left. Oh, five minutes still. Save as. Save. Save nine. Okay. Return to game. Let's run and find ourselves a guild master. You're not the guild master. Where's the just a guy? Uh, you must be the guild master. You're standing around doing nothing. Guild master. I by land. Very good, sir. We didn't go to no one trust you, even though we've never met you. Never mind. How does the wealth of the region compare to the rest of Calvadia? Over the wealthiest town in Calvadia is known to be Vulca. Here in Sargoth we are poorer than four towns and richer than seventeen. Okay. Producing town in Calvadia is known to be Vulca. Here in Sargoth we produce at least less than three towns. Produce blah 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 blah. Does the output... Just tell me... Okay, whatever, blah blah blah. Buy land. Don't care about politics right now. Profit would be negative 66. No, that's not economical for me at all. Wall. Profit would be 54 dinars a week. Lever. 175. I can't afford that though. Wine from grapes. 60. Oil from olives. 278, that's pretty good. I'm gonna go for everything else. Can't afford that. Oh, probably 500 a week, though. Tools from iron. Ah, 212. That's 3,500. So it's olive from grapes. Should be 275 for 4,500. Yeah, here, I'll have that. Leave. That's a pretty good. I got myself a second enterprise. Leave. Now that I've got myself uh, well, more money, I'm still going to be losing money, but I'll be gaining more through, like, bleh, more through killing people without remorse because I'm insane. Pretty much that. My character just doesn't matter, doesn't care when I, when he murders hundred he's murdered hundreds of people and he hasn't batted an eyelash. So sort of, sort of gone, okay, I've killed these people, sell their stuff and then I'll get more money. Charge the enemy. Men kill. But yeah I'm gonna wait until Swadi is at a time of war and I will take one of the the castles that are near their edge. And then, if I have enough time, maybe a second one. Then a third, and so on and so forth, until I have... Uh, maybe an empire, or until 25 episodes are done up. If I've got myself a... A pretty decent size, that'll be happy. If I only have a single castle, well then I've succeeded in my goal at least, so, yeah. Level 20, ah, level 12. That's, that's pretty cool. How many people left? A few. I am so much more powerful than all of these people combined. Do you know what the best part is? When, uh, when I take a castle, it's probably going to be almost entirely populated by uh, really 
you know, like, low-tier enemies. But, with a few high-tier ones, but well, I can just take care of. Or I met all my uh, archers can snipe from afar. So that's going to be pretty cool. Continue. Your man at arms. I've leveled up. Your warrior. Your veteran crossbowman. And your trained crossbowman. And more stuff to sell. 4G, 4G. Okay, it's the same. I have enough space, I think. If not, no, I don't. But I don't need those two things. Vashi. To Vashi. Let's have a talk. Ah, she likes me quite a lot. We talk about your skills. Increase your intelligence. Then your engineer ability. And your engineer ability again. And then your archery. Never mind. And then myself. Done. Character. Increase my... What do I want to increase? Um, trainer? Nah. Tracking? Ooh, looting's always nice. Can increase looting. And first aid. Surgery. Ooh, inventory management, in fact. I can hold more stuff. And increase my my charisma? Nah. In fact, yeah, charisma, because that increases my leadership. Which means I can hold more people in my uh, party. Because I'm going to build that up. Now I've got a few more productive enterprises, that's what, in fact what I'm going to do. I'm going to go around and buy more men, then I'll end the video. Recruit volunteers. Two more people. Good. You'll be you'll be overjoyed to have be part in my amazing party. Recruit volunteers. Five. The more the merrier. I mean, chasing people is going to take a bit longer, like Swadi and, uh, like, uh, freaking enemies. You're looted. Yep, you're burnt out husk. Ha. Uh, don't worry, I'm gonna make it even worse when I start war with you all. Recruit volunteers. And move over to the Vodok territory. Yep, I gained 218 from the uh, wine parlor, so it should be getting 400 next week. That's gonna lower the cost of stuff insurmountably. Party! Who's leveled up? Not recruits. More footmen. So I've got, so now my thing's inc basically doubled my party has. Yep, and it's 33, 23 minutes. So with that, I will leave the video. Next up, folks, leveling up. And then, I think soon we're going to be able to take on our castle. In fact, I'm going to choose a castle to take out. Hmm, what well, looks nice? Maybe, Rendy... Rinda. One of those three. One of these three. This corner looks nice. I like to get start here and sort of move down into Swadia, eventually taking on as much as possible until I own the entire continent. Then I'll move from there, moving out to whoever I dislike next, until eventually the entire planet is under my grasp. But that's not until a while. So, next up, folks, leveling up. Until then, folks. Until then. Bye.